and a very warm welcome back to Tony Northeastern. We have the Nighthawk here, uh, which is a Northeastern A3 class in wartime black. She's going to be pulling the brand new Backman coaches, uh, which have just arrived today. And here they are. I have a rake of six of them. Now I ordered these back in January 2016 when um, Backman first suggested um, releasing these. So I've waited a while, over a year and a half, but it's well worth the wait. Um, what I particularly want to show you is I have a Batman um, upside down in the cradle here. And if you take out the bogey, you see it's got pickups on the wheels. And uh, I thought to myself when I first saw them, oh, they've got lights already in. But they haven't. But what it is, is they've installed the pickups in already. This is a bit fiddly to do one handed. So when you take it out, you turn it over and look. Not only has it got pickups in ready, you've got two um, soldering points to put the cables onto. I think is a brilliant touch from Backman and you've also got the slots there to feed the cables through so at some point in the future I'll be fitting lights into these so I think on that score alone it's well worth the 40 odd pounds each that I paid for these I was looking into getting the Hornby Grizzly ones, but uh, when I first started looking for teaks, but um, they've gone sky high in price they have now. So let's have a look at the other details. Just gently flip it over. Nice close up on. I don't know if they're sprung buffers, no they're fixed buffers. Fixed buffers on that. But you get all sorts of detail on that. And if you go really close up you can actually see the teak streaks of the timbers. Right, I've just turned it on its side so you can actually see um, uh, more of the underside detail up close. Uh, there's the battery bollock boxes and some cylinders there. Here's cylinders probably for the va vacuums system. And we've got close couplings there. Um, so yes, in all, nice detail. I'll just quickly flip it over. detail is quite incredible. And you also get some other couplings as well. These are even closer couplings. Uh, but I'm not sure my radiuses will um, take those. I'll have to give them a test at some point on maybe just a couple. Now, the, the, just a little bit of a history on the Nighthawk model there. She's an old um, tender drive model that's been converted to DCC. Um, she can be a bit temperamental 
it's probably due to the push fit coupling that's in between the tender and the engine but um, she runs very very smooth as you're going to see right so that's enough of me waffling let's see these in action
Right, I uh, hope you've enjoyed what you've seen. But um, that is truly a nice addition to the layout. Um, I'm well pleased with the way Batman have um, put these ticks together. Um, this layout was crying out for a rig of ticks. And uh, now we have some. Well worth the wait, I think. So I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen. Um, thank you for watching. And maybe next time we'll have an update on the layout of what's been happening. And maybe a start of a new project. We'll see. So, ta-da for now. Catch you next time. Bye.